Fourth question, the following information obtained by taking a sample of 10 students from the student of science college. Here the number of students are given, marks in mathematics and marks in statistics. So again here you can see there is no rank is given. It will remove the rank out of this information. And here at the end ask for the rank correlation coefficient between the ability of the students and the subject of mathematics and statistics. So let's take this information in table. After taking into the table, just give them rank. First of all, find out the maximum one. That is, I, see, I can see it's a 78. Give the rank 1. Next is 90. That is 2. 82. 3. The next one I can see is 78. 4. This is how you have to go to give the rank. I'll just complete with the Rx and Ry. So give firmly the rank to the marks of the mathematics and marks of the statistic in Rx and Ry. Then after we'll find out D by subtracting these two column. 8 minus 10 will get minus 2. 6 minus 8 again minus 2. 7 minus 7 0. 2 minus 2 0. 3 minus 5 we will get minus 2. 5 minus 4 1. 10 minus 6 4 1 1. 0 9 minus 9 0 4 minus 3 1 so after getting this remove d square 2 2 is a 4 4 0 0 4 1 16 0 0 1 and here we get the total of sigma d square is 30 now the process is simple just put them into the formula n is 10 10 square minus 1 6 minus 30 you will get 180 10 10 square means 100 minus 1 1 minus 180 10 here we get 99 1 minus 180 will get 990 get this calculate 180 divided by 990 you will get 0 0.18 get them minus and the answer is 0 0.82 don't forget to write down hence the rate rank correlation coefficient between the ability of student in the subject maths and statistics is obtained 0.80. Next question number 5 from the following information of height of a husband and wife calculate rank correlation coefficient between their height. So here height of a husband is given and height of a wife is given. So first of all let's take the information in the book. So here I wrote the information out of this information. You can first of all check the numbers is any numbers are repeated. In this column I can see any number is repeating but over here we can find that these two numbers are repeating. Even these two numbers are repeating. So that I will show you how it has to be go with. But first of all let's give the rank to the Rx. This is the maximum number I can see here. So here we will give first rank next is this second rank third one is this fourth then fifth sixth and seventh after giving rank of this let's move to the next one here we can see the maximum number is 170 with the first rank next is 162 so obviously here we are going to give the second and third Remember, अगर आपके सामने दो numbers आ जाते हैं, तो आपको second and third. This is how you have to count. Take this two number, that is two plus three, because there are two numbers. तो एक को हम second देते, एक को हम third देते, पर दोनों same हैं, इसलिए हम लिखेंगे two plus three divided by the numbers how many time has been repeated will be divided. So two plus three will be five divided by two, you will get two point five. So that's what the rank you will give for the both the numbers. That is 2.5, 2.5. And if you check the next number out of this, the maximum one is 157. So here you will give the number 4 because second and third has been included in this two. Next after giving 4, we'll go to this number as a 5, that is 154. The next one, okay, 154, there are two numbers, so 5 and 6. 
for again we'll take 5 plus 6 because you can see 154 there are twicely has been re repeated in the height of a wife so 5 plus 6 divide by 2 agar ye 3 bar repeat hota to hum divide by 3 karte by taking the one more rank so jitne numbers apne liye hain utna aapko divide karna hai so here we'll get 11.2 and the answer will be 5.5 so that's what we'll take here 5.5 for this and even for this number so after giving this which we have already included the number 5 and 6th rank the remaining will be 7th when the numbers are repeated remember the formula has to be changed by this to find out cf here i will show you the table first of all write down the repeated number the first repeated number was 162 how many time it has been repeated repetition that is twice it has been repeated so 2 have to be written which will be denoted as m out of this you have to remove the calculation for this that twice it has been calculated sorry repeated and here again 2 divide by so here 2 2 is a 4 4 2 is a 8 8 minus 2 divide by 12 that is 6 minus 12 here we get the answer 0 0.5 next number was 154 so just write down the number 154 which has been repeated twice which will be denoted as m and just keep into the formula again obviously the answer will be same that is 0 0.5 get them total that is a cf 0 0.5 plus 0 0.5 obviously it will be 1 so then after we will go to calculate D that is the subtraction of this two column and here the answer 6 minus 5.5 that is 0 0.5 7 minus 7 0 2 minus 2.5 will be minus 0 0.5 5 minus 4 1 3 minus 2.5 that is 0 0.5 1 minus 1 0 4 minus 5.5 here we get minus 1.5 then remove the D square. 0 0.5 whole square uh, multiplied by 0 0.5 you will get 0 0.25 0 minus 0. Point, no minus after putting the square 1 ones are 1 again 0 0.25 0 and here you will get 2.25 get the total of this that is 4 after getting the answer just keep them into the formula 1 minus 6 sigma d square that we found 4 plus cf we found that is 1 divide by the numbers are 7 7 square minus 1 1 minus 6 4 plus 1 will be 5 7 7 square means 49 minus 1 1 minus 6 5s are 30 7 into 49 minus 1 will remain 48. 1 minus 30 divided by 7 multiplied by 48 you will get 336. Get this calculation 1 minus 0 0.09 and here we get the answer 0 0.91. Don't forget to write down that hence the rank correlation coefficient between the height of the husband and the wife is obtained. 0.91 moving to the next question number six two interviewer gave the following score to the candidate on the basis of their performance in the interview find the rank correlation coefficients between the evaluation of two interviewer here the candidates from a to h is given and again the marks has been given so to call the numbers and tables in the book here first of all let's First find out is any numbers are repeated. Here you can see the 28 has been repeated. No other. In this column I can see these two numbers are repeating. So let's start. First of all find out the maximum number in this row that is 47 which will be ranked as a 1. Next is 44. Second. Next is 40. Third. The next I found 35 which will be ranked as 4. 
after 35 I think directly it comes with 28 so that wins 5 and 6 so 5 plus 6 rank divide by 2 you will get 5.5 5 plus 6 11 11 divided by 2 will be 5.5 so we'll give both of them 5.5 that is 5 and 6 fifth and sixth rank has been given next is seventh and here we give 8 moving to the next for this column here we can see the maximum number is 45 which will be ranked as 1 next is 41 2 next 38 3 and the next one is 32 I can see the one more 32 so here there are three times it has been repeated the first second third has been already given so this number will get four five sixth rank so first write down four plus five plus six so this will be 15 divide by three remember apne jitne rank upar rikhe hai utne se apko divide karna hai so here if we divide here we get the answer 15 divided by 3 that is 5. So all three numbers will get 5th rank and 5th. So here we complete 4, 5, 6. So next number will be given 7th rank. So here we find out this one is more 7 and here 8th. So after giving the rank the next stage is D. But before we go over there let's remove CF the repeated number from x we found 28 which was repeated twice sec two times so here we'll write down 2 cube minus 2 divide by 12 2 2 is a 4 4 2 is a 8 8 minus 2 6 6 divide by 12 you will get 0 0.5 next in the y column we found number 32 which has been repeated thrice Teen bar will repeat hua, right? So 3 cube minus 3 divided by 12. 3 3 is a 9. 9 3 is a 27. 27 minus 3, 24. 24 divided by 12. Here we get 2. So add them. Here we get the answer for CF. The total of this 2 will be 2.5. Next, let's remove D by subtracting this 2 column. That is 5.5 minus 5. Here we get 0 0.5. 2 minus 1, 1. 8 minus 7, 1. 5.5 minus 5 will be 0 0.5. 1 minus 2. That is minus 1. 4 minus 5, minus 1. 7 minus 8, minus 1. 3 minus 3, 0. Next, d square. 0 0.5 uh, multiplied by 0 0.5 will be 0 0.25. 1, 1, 0 0.25. 1, 1, 1. 0 and here we get the total of sigma d square 5.50 so here we have sigma d square as well as cf so just take them into the formula 1 minus 6 5.50 plus cf is 2.5 number is 10 Sorry, it's 8. 1 minus 6. 5.50 plus 2.5. Here we get 8. 8. 8 eights are 64. Minus 1. 6 eights are 48. 8. 64 minus 1 will be 63. 8 multiplied by 63 you will get 504. Remove the calculation of this 2 you will get 0 0.10. Get them minus here the answer 0 0.90. Don't forget to write. Hence the rank correlation coefficient between the evaluation of two interviewer obtained is 0 0.90. Next. Next. 